I've got a shard to open and that's all I need to have a good day. And I didn't even have to pay for it because we're on the free to play, ladies and gentlemen. We're getting our peasant freebie shard. And is there any more peasant packs? There is a peasant pack. I will take it. And I think that's, is that all the dopamine we have for right now? Well, let's go. One time, no whammies. I guess the two X is for sacreds, but it doesn't matter. Let's see what we get today, ladies and gentlemen. Where's our legendary? Okay. Mom, we already had one. You know, I think I recorded this, but it didn't end up in a video anywhere. We we got a bellower with our void shard. The one that you get in the uh, daily login here. Where was it? The first 30 days. This one right here, the day 29 shard gave us a bellower. Oh, lovely. It's the coin thing again. That's gone so well for me every time. We did get 75 gems from getting rank four of the champion training, though. That's kind of nice. I mean, I'll take that. I mean, I normally don't expect to place it all in those. And we have our clan boss rewards from the final night chest on the normal, so we can maybe move up to hard now. Oh, five gems. Holy moly. Actually, we're not ready to move up to hard because we're not going to get anywhere near that 11 million damage. We're doing pretty good in PvP also. As soon as we win this one, we're going to be silver two. And we've got plenty of the bars that you get for winning, the ones that we need in the forge. So it's probably getting pretty close to that time. If we actually look at the faction wars here, I don't think there's... Yeah, Skimwalker, Night Revenant. I don't think there's anybody yeah, that we have. Yeah, we got a couple like unleveled epics here. And for Skimwalkers, what we got? We got nothing. So um, for right now, what we have is maybe a couple things that we can open in the Forge. What we got for Resilience? We have, it looks like we could do two for the five stars. For the Perception, we can do, it looks like two of these. So we are going to row the Perceptions for sure right now because we definitely want either Speed Boots for these or, you know, I don't really even know what I want. Um, so I'm not really going to worry about it too much. I'm going to put attack percentage as a secondary just because I don't want attack percentage as a secondary. And let's see what we get here. Okay, and oh, we got legendary. All right, so it's a four star, which is a bummer, but it's speed and it's perception. So we'll keep, we'll keep it. It's a legendary and speed. I mean, it could still have some pretty good ones. Uh, another four star and it has speed. Okay, so same logic. We're going to keep it, but that's that was pretty much highly disappointing. I'm going to be real. Uh, let's go back to resilience. Let's go ahead and now that I didn't get the dopamine I wanted, we're going to go ahead and do these ones so that maybe we can get the dopamine when we're looking for a five star. There's a five star. Crit damage and accuracy. Um, we're still looking for a good, a good, you know what? I'm just not feeling any of those. We're stuck on winning five greater potions, which are not open right now. How long do we have before this? That opens Saturday. So in six hours. We've got a bunch more potential four-star chickens here. So probably what we need to do is start asking ourselves the next question, which is what is going to be our next six star? Or what are we really focusing on? Because we've been basically just focusing on getting the dopamine. We haven't really asked ourselves any of those hard questions. And I think what we need to do is make sure that we have a clan boss team so that we can get more dopamine. Because the only thing we actually really care about is shards, right? It seems like we only really care about shards on this account. So if we want more shards for free, we're gonna need to hit the clan boss harder. So for that reason, we're gonna worry about the clan boss. Rhonda's good in the clan boss. Banshee's good in the clan boss. So I think we six star these since we already have Kel's six star and then our clan boss team's going to be looking significantly better. Obviously, we need to finish the Ascension and we also need to finish the missions here so that way we can get ourselves. Oh my lord, I want to close all this, please. We need to finish these missions so that way we can get up to the Sacred Shard to get that dopamine as well. So we're going to farm these as soon as this comes out. Kind of curious how this legendary with speed is going to go. We have instant upgrade now. We're, can we do the instant upgrade to, is it, do, let's see, how does this work? I've never done this before. Instantly upgrade the piece of gear that chosen level, skipping all animations. We still haven't. So, okay, so it's just, uh, it just skips the animations. All it does, straight to four. All right, so what the road? Crit damage, okay, straight to, straight to eight. Wow, they really like that one, huh? I mean, that gets you to spin the, that gets you to spin the silver pretty quickly, don't it? See, there you go, speed. We could go to 16. I mean, I don't know why it would. It'd be a big waste of silver, but you could do it. See, 665,000. And again. Uh. All right, then one click, bang. Speed twice right there. And misses it twice. Rhonda's gear can be massively improved as well. We do have critical hit gloves on her, which I'm not really feeling. I feel like we could get her stronger. Uh, we could wear this, which gets more. You know, we're just going to put this on now. I think that's just a better thing to have on her. So that makes her stronger already feel like I could use some really good crit damage rolls, so I just kind of want to see what we get here. Um, maybe that's good enough to go to 12, just to see if we get another one. Accuracy, I mean, it's not terrible. I don't hate it. I just can't really use it, I don't think. 
Definitely worth upgrading these pair of boots though. These are a relentless set, five star speed boots. One of the only ones I have. You know what? I actually kind of want to ascend it. Let's see what happens when you actually ascend this here. Can I row speed again? I got flat HP, so. I was able to get her mildly stronger. Now, uh, we still have some books saved for her for when we get the opportunity for that. We still need crit damage ring and all that, but we got to get, um, we've got to get obviously the ascension for it first. And we're getting closer to actually having the masteries, which really matter. You have to be six star for that anyway. We have some challenges that have been completed here. There we go. We're getting really close to the upgrade. Six artifacts to four or higher and 12. Okay, so 12 to four or higher will get us an artifact challenge, which will get us another book. Our Fire Knight team is supposed to be getting pretty strong now, because if you actually look at what our team is, we have, where is it? Ballast Age with the speed up. We have the double hit from Frozen Banshee, obviously the four hit from Kel, the triple hit constantly from Rhonda, and then we have the uh, block heal reduction, as well as the defense down, another triple hit from him. So we also have Warden, who does the counter, but he's only level 33 and he still is lacking a bit, but we're, we, he's gonna be in the team. That's stage nine's down already, which actually, to be honest, I'm pretty happy with. Uh, on to the next stage. I think we'll be able to beat this stage way easier because we're the stronger affinity. Able to complete stage 10 as well. That's pretty good. If you're wondering why I'm doing the Fire Knight, I don't have any reason. I just felt like it. We should be able to complete this last one, which is win a campaign battle using four champions of level 50 and higher to get an epic book. And we should be able to do these artifact ones to get a rare book. So... That's looking pretty good. I don't know if we can, we, yeah, we probably can't complete these ones today for the for the shard because that takes multiple days. And the arena ones, we still need to get into gold, but we can complete these two. Just feeding my common champions, which isn't really the best strategy in the world, but I'm feeding them to the one guy. Oh, here we got one of these, these people too. I don't really need her. So she's probably gonna end up being a chicken to be honest with you, but we are slowly feeding. You see this, I'm upgrading my level. I'm just dropping in my one stars to this guy. And then we're gonna level him because once he's 50, we can get that epic book. Okay, so I went and ran my multi-battles. We got 14, and then what happened? We ran out of energy, we ran out of energy. Well, we still need like two and a half levels left. The dailies aren't exactly all the way completed either. We can fight in the classic arena to get a refill. Okay, dailies are completed, and now what we're gonna do is we are going to do that level 50 mission where if we go and put all of our dudes four dudes one thing level 50 what am i trying to say let me show you this one do this thing aha we did it and now we get ourselves the epic book which means we can work on getting the legendary book and we need to get magic champion to rank six. Oh my goodness we this is going to take a minute so now for the rare book we should be able to do this just got to upgrade some things to level four we, we have enough silver that shouldn't be a problem the instantaneous is gonna make this super easy and, and quick to do, just like that. There we go, and that one's completed. Both of those are, and that is going to give us a rare book now, which opens up the next rare book challenge, which looks actually pretty easy. Speaking of pretty easy, no one's really doing this arena battle challenge. There's not really good rewards for it, but we could make some progress on that if we really wanted to. Oh ho ho, ladies and gentlemen, just like that, we have another shard. This is a perfect way to end it. One time, no whammies. Legendary, please. And we get a rare. What do we get? Another, not another tree fell. All right, well, feels kind of bad. But ladies and gentlemen, we started it with some dopamine. We ended it with some dopamine. Love y'all. Like and sub if you want to. See you on the next episode.